The chairman of selectors Chris Srikanth who has hit out at Jimmy Amarnath for revealing what happened in the selection meeting. In fact, Srikanth has said he's never revealed what discussions took place in the selection meeting. Definitely yes. There are so many things that are being select, uh, discussed in the selection committee meeting. So many people have been asked me, asked questions even after my selection committee tenure was over, whether I spoke to players, well, what did I speak, what happened, and all those things. But I always believe that what we as selectors and me as chairman in the past, even today, I don't come and tell anybody what I spoke to the players, what happened or what transpired in the selection committee meeting. I don't think it's right for anyone to come out to the public and tell what happened within the four walls of a selection committee meeting. But whatever happens within a selection committee meeting, it should be within the four walls. And I don't think uh, anyone should come out in the public and say what exactly transpired. So I always believe that uh, there are so many meetings, everything is discussed in the selection committee meeting. We discuss a lot of issues. Yes, this captaincy issues of Dhoni's or X, Y, Z, also always comes up in the selection committee meeting. We always have a lot of detailed discussions on uh, a captain's issue, on the ex-player, what to do with ex-player, what kind of team combination we have. And uh, definitely in a selection committee meeting, we have a lot of discussions, arguments. We agree, and end of the day, end of the day, it's always a consensus. There has never been a, what do you call, we never go by, I think end of the day, it's a selection committee of five people, because what we are doing is for the good of the country. Yesterday you said that nobody has the guts to uh, remove uh, Mahinder Singh Dhoni. Why did you say that? Oh, very true. If you see his track record for the last one year as a captain, uh, I'm talking about only test matches, not one day. He's done very well in one day cricket. Uh, he hasn't done much, to be very honest. He's not led from the front. He has not uh, set the ground fire or fire uh, kind of a thing. And uh, so I feel, you know, like I think rules should be the same for everybody. Because uh, if you are there in the team, I think as a captain, I think first of all your place should be secure in the side, which I don't see that uh, his place is secure because he hasn't performed much as a batsman, neither as a keeper. It's not that key, I don't like him, I respect the guy, whatever he has done, whatever he's done for Indian cricket, whatever he's achieved. But I think end of the day, what is important is Indian cricket. I think we have to think of Indian cricket, we have to move ahead, we should not be just uh, sitting there. I completely agree with you.